Hi there. Today is Friday. Um, I didn't do anything today. Uh, except that Haley just finished packing to go to Renew, which is the, uh, youth group, um, retreat. Youth group winter retreat. <laughs> um, so she got all her clothes packed and her blankets and jackets and everything she needs. Um, she leaves tomorrow at about 12.30 and um, comes back on Monday about the same time. 12.45 is what they say. So, uh, since Monday is uh, Martin Luther King Day, did I explain this yesterday? Probably did. Monday's Martin Luther King Day, so they're, um, yeah, they're not leaving until Saturday, so they don't have to worry about school. Yeah, I remember now. I didn't mention that. Uh, anyway, so she is excited about going. Um, her friends from church will be there, and it's always a good time, so. Um, let's see. Like I said, we really didn't do a darn thing today. In fact, I didn't even finish school with Nathan today, so I'll be doing that tomorrow. Probably after I drop Haley off, so. Uh, and we'll do our 100 day thing tomorrow afternoon. Um, and then Sunday we'll be going to church without Haley, obviously, because she won't be here. Uh, and uh, that's probably about all I've got. I've been watching Toby Games today. That's part of the reason I have my glasses on. And my, my eyes are so tired from staring at my phone all day. I should have been over on the laptop watching it, but I didn't think about it really until I'd already been doing it, watching it on my phone for a while. Um, I guess that's all I've got to say today. Um, I can't think of anything. Buddy hasn't texted me. I don't think he's texted me at all today. Which is kind of strange, but not terribly strange. I think he said um, that he was teaching today. So that would explain why he didn't text kind of during the day. Although he usually does it like lunch or something. Maybe he's teaching. He hasn't texted me at all this afternoon and this evening. So, I don't know. I guess he's been busy or bored or I don't know anyway um I st today's Friday and I still have not clipped two weeks worth of coupons last Sundays and the Sunday before so if I don't do it tomorrow which I probably won't I'll end up with three weeks worth of coupons that I need to cut up and file away that's kind of annoying a bit so Oh, I've been so busy doing other stuff that I haven't even gotten around to that. Um, tomorrow morning we need to clean the house up a little bit. It's starting to get a little bit messy. There's some things on the floor that don't belong on the floor. Some dishes in the living room that don't belong in the living room. What the heck is that thing over there? Some blue thing that I don't recognize. Ugh, my eyes are so tired. Anyway, um, I also need to find my remote. Um, yeah, the kids have been watching TV all day, and they played out in the backyard, got all muddy, got the windows that I just cleaned the other day, put muddy handprints all over them, four muddy handprints all over them, so I had to rinse the mud off the outside of the window already today. Um... Anyway, I think that's about it. I'm sleepy. I'm gonna go to bed. Um, I'm reading this book that Haley got from the library. This is actually an advanced copy. The Uncorrected Advanced Proof is what it's called. Anyway, it's called Bang. And it's good. Here's the cover. And it's by... Who's it by? Right there. Sharon Flake. Sharon G. Flake. Not someone I've ever heard of. Anyway. 
There it is. That's good. There's the back effect. There's she and herself right there. And her little bio. Um. <coughs> uh, it's about a boy called Man. With two N's. And, um. I haven't gotten very far into it. I'm, uh. Right. There. That's how far I am into it. This small section here. Um. Anyway, it's about this boy. Named Man who. Uh, I guess lives in the inner city of some, I don't think they've said which city, but, uh, and he's 13, and two years ago, in the story, his younger brother, uh, was shot, um, it wasn't exactly a drive-by, but it was basically the same thing. Some guy was running from some other guy, and, um, the guy that was chasing shot or shot at the guy that he was chasing and um, hit the younger brother and so he's having to deal with um, he and his family <clears throat> are having to deal with that and so he's having to deal with his family's reaction to that and his own of course um, and everything so anyway so far it's a good book Haley really enjoyed it so uh, she told me I should read it so, yeah, I'm going to bed, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.